We're going to explain how to reset your Akai MPK Mini 3. There are actually a couple of ways to reset it, depending on what kind of reset you need. 1. The first is a simple power cycle. This is the easiest way to clear any temporary glitches or problems. Just unplug the MPK Mini 3 from your computer or power supply, wait about 10 seconds, and then plug it back in. This often resolves minor issues like unresponsive keys or flickering LEDs. 2. If a simple power cycle doesn't work, you might need to perform a factory reset. This will restore the MPK Mini 3 to its default settings, erasing any custom mappings or presets you've created. To do a factory reset, you'll need to locate the tiny recessed reset button on the back or bottom of your MPK Mini 3. You'll probably need a small pointed object like a pen or a paper clip to press it. 3. Before you press the reset button, make sure your MPK Mini 3 is powered on. With the unit powered on, locate the reset button. Gently press and hold the reset button for at least 5 seconds, but sometimes holding it down for 10, 15 seconds is recommended. You might see some LEDs blink or flash to indicate that the reset is in progress. 4. Once you release the reset button, your MPK Mini 3 should restart. After it's rebooted, all its settings will be back to their factory defaults. 5. This means any custom MIDI mappings, control assignments, or user presets you had will be gone. You'll have to reconfigure your MPK Mini 3 to your preferences. 6. Remember to check your computer's MIDI settings as well. If you are using any custom mappings within your DAW software, like Ableton Live, Logic Pro X, or FL Studio, you may need to re-establish those connections and MIDI assignments after the reset. 7. If you're still having problems after trying both a power cycle and a factory reset, it's possible that there's a more serious hardware issue with your MPK Mini 3. In this case, you should consult the Akai Professional website for support or contact their customer service for assistance. They might have troubleshooting steps or might need to repair your device. Always back up your important settings whenever possible to avoid data loss.